It was great to finally have a bit of one-on-one -on -one time with Abby and see how she felt about the time she spent here at Mamma Mia. So when you're a content producer um, in a digital media company, you are on constant deadlines. You have to produce it pretty quickly. I mean, there are some stories that, that take longer. Yeah. It just depends. You have to have that speed muscle of writing in, in peak form. Yep. So I think probably the, the best thing for you to do is to try to get in that habit of blogging daily, if you can, just for yep. yourself. If I was gonna give you a couple of tips, it would be work on your speed. Mm -hmm. uh, work on writing stories that aren't quite as focused on your own personal experience. Yep. Try to think about um, what's going to be interesting to a broader audience mm -hmm. rather than just people who know me. You know, it's not about just getting a full-time gig. It's mm -hmm. hard to get gigs in media. But my advice to, to so many women who want to change careers or start something of their own as a lady startup is think of writing for you as a side hustle. You don't have to look at moving cities, giving up your job, giving up that financial security. Yep. But you can just start to, to hone your skills. You never know what opportunities are gonna come up. And yep. so much of it is just about maintaining those contacts. Mm -hmm. We're always looking for writers. You don't have to have a full-time job to have your work uh, published or be commissioned uh, on Mamma Mia. So there's no reason why she can't start pitching to us as a freelancer. Start writing, start pitching. Yeah. Her words of encouragement were fabulous. Thank you so much. My pleasure. It's I've been loved it. having you here. It has been great to spend some time in this environment. I've really enjoyed it. I've learnt some things. I've got inspired and I can't wait to keep writing.